dear friends if this video is helpful to you then remember to hit the like button share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel for future sessions and if you have any questions or comments make sure to leave them so that we will get back to you now coming to guava by grafting on dwarfing rootstock like Aneuploid number 82, which is also known as Pusa Sirangel, high density planting can be achieved in guava also. A full bearing high density guava orchard on Aneuploid 82 rootstock may yield 18 to 20 tons per hectare as compared to 8 to 10 tons per hectare in low density planting. The planting distance varies from 5.5 to 7.5 meter. The double hedgerow system of planting, wherein 800 to 900 plants per hectare is beneficial for achieving high yield per unit area in Alabas Feda cultivar of Goa. At Central Institute of Subtropical Horticulture Lucknow, planting of guava was tried at four different dynasties that are 1.5 meter by 3.5 wherein 2,222 plants per hectare were accommodated, 3 meter by 3 meter spacing with the plants of 1,111 plants per hectare, 3 meter by 6 meter spacing having 5,555 plants per hectare and 6 meter by 6 meter spacing accommodating 277 plants per hectare, wherein an average yield of 73 kg 41 kg, 26 kg and 13 kg per plant respectively was obtained from pruned trees in comparison to 57 kg, 29 kg, 22 kg and 10 kg per plant respectively under unpruned trees from above dynasties. Middle orcharding or ultra high dynasty planting system of guava gives very high productivity with superior fruit quality. The plants are spaced at 1 meter by 2 meter accommodating 5000 plants per hectare. The canopy management of this system is done by topping and hedging. The plants of 2 months are topped in the month of October for emergence of new shoots below cut. 50% length of each new shoot will be pruned again in the month of December or January for induction of more shoots and flower bud differentiation. A well spread canopy is attained by the month of May. Heading back of all the shoots is repeated annually in the month of September, May and January which ensures dwarf, compact canopy, better fruiting and easy cultural operations. The Gawa cultivar Lalit Shweta performs very well under high dynasty planting. Thank you.